What is up guys, GCMSE here and welcome to another hybrid squad builder on FIFA 13 on the team. This is going to be a 4-3-1-2, I thought I'd vary up the uh, formation a little bit as uh, I kind of want to try them all out this year. Uh, last year I kind of focused on the 4-2-3-1 as it is piss for um, piss be, uh, easy to make them hybrid squads. So starting off, um, there are a fair few club links in this squad but overall it's around 180,000 coins I believe. Uh, so starting off in goal we have got Aranha, Aranha? <laughs> Aranha of Santos. This guy in goal is incredible. I'll actually include some saves there, some clips at the end. And honestly, one of the best goalkeepers I've ever used on FIFA 13. Um, this game at the moment, I'm finding really tedious to play. Uh, that's why I tweeted out like literally an hour ago, uh, saying that with squad builders, I will actually, uh, I'm actually going to be playing subs for a lot of the clips now at the end. As generally online, I'm not finding it fun at all. And this year, I'm pretty finding clubs and head-to-head. Uh, quite superior to all my team. Uh, all my team, if it added single match pack, I maybe uh, like it again, but generally I've lost my interest in it at the moment. Uh, but I still will be playing like subs and that as I fight. Uh, friend matches are really fun, and I sure uh, show myself that um, the playing subs will be fun as well. At uh, right back, we have got Opara of uh, Standard Liège, 90 pace. He's from Ghana. Um, I believe that's Ghana. Yep. And he is very, very fast, like I said, 90 pace. Good defending, cost me 2,800 coins, so the first two players are both uh, pretty pretty cheap. The uh, first centre back we are going to have is Kanu of Standard Liège again, so that's the first club link. And overall, he's 6 foot 2, he's a non shiny, uh, 80 pace, 72 defending, and 78 heading. Uh, very good player, 5,600 coins, and um, his strength in game seems to be very high as well. The person that looks out of him is Antonio Ferreira of uh, in the Russian league. 81 pace, 76, uh, no, 67 defending and 67 heading. Uh, three star skills, three star weak feet, six foot three. And on FIFA 12, he was actually my favourite centre back. And his long shots on this one aren't. I actually haven't had any uh, attempts of him because I haven't really got the ball in uh, the room. Finish off this defence then, we have got Evaldo of Deportivo La Coruña. Um, I believe that's what the uh, club name is, or RC Deportivo in Liga BVA. Um, he's an alternative to like the likes of Marcel Azevedo. You can have any Brazil left back in this team. Uh, but I've got to Valdo. he's 83 pace, 70 defending, and a 6 foot 1 as well, that's very tall for a left back, and I, I do quite like my height in the, uh, the wing backs. So onto the midfield, we have starting this like this midfield off with Gisile, um, I think that's how you say his name, usually a centre defensive midfielder, um, very very pricey, 51,000 coins, uh, 80 pace, he has actually got 4 star skills, 3 star weak foot, um, 74 passing, 75 dribbling, and 72 defending, 70, uh, no, 70 heading, so overall very good player. And he is 51,000 coins, like I said. So he's, he is, uh, I think it's the second most expensive player in this squad. The next player we've got is going to be Maniatis. He's usually a centre defensive mid also, uh, but he's very good at covering in the centre. Uh, 5'9", 73 defending and 77 pace. Uh, he does cover well with this guy that I'm going to put next to him straight away. Paolo Makedo or Machida. I don't know how you say his name. In game, this guy's got 80 uh, free kick accuracy and 90 shot power. Uh, it's absolutely incredible and um, a very good player. Possibly my favourite midfielder, silver wise, on this game as far. He's only got one goal in six games, but his long shot, I can assure you, is incredible. Um, they, I don't think there's any in the clips, but I have scored in previous squads with him. And uh, if you try him out yourself, take long shots with him, they will go on target most of the time. 2,500 coins, uh, and them stats all round are absolutely incredible. Uh, Played for Olympiacos, the same as Magnatis, and them two link up with Fet Vasilis. Five star skiller at centre forward, usually a uh, centre attack in mid. Five goals in six games, 10,000 coins. Uh, it's quite short. It took me a while to get used to him. He used to, he used to be like amazing on FIFA uh, 12. And he is pretty, uh, just a little bit worse. Uh, but that's because he's got like a minus six in his pace this year. On to the two final strikers. Starting things off, we've got Big Lukaku. This guy is so overpowered again. Uh, well, actually, I'm not going to call it overpowered because in real life he's very fast and tall. So. Going on from that, 81 pace, 73 shooting. Uh, he's got 9 goals in 6 games for me. 61,000 coins. So he's this, uh, uh, the most expensive player in this squad. Along with uh, just Sile there. And he links up with Benteke. You could modify this squad to be a gold and silver team. Um, like you could replace Benteke with Morales. But overall, I find um, Morales, not Morales, Benteke better than Lukaku. Uh, Lukaku is 6'3 of 81 pace. Benteke is 6'4 with 80 pace. But this guy's shot is absolutely outstanding. Four star weak foot, nine goals in six games, 17,000 coins. So the squad overall is very solid defensively. So you've got two cent defensive mids and uh, someone that just attacks quite a lot. And up front, you've got the two big guys that are pacey and very strong, followed by a little guy with pace and five star skills. So that is a team. Uh, it's got an average pace of around 83, I believe. 
uh, if not more. And it's, uh, like I said, un under 200k. But that has been the video, guys. If you enjoyed this video, if you could drop a like, that'd be beast. Um, if, if it, yeah, <laughs> I can't talk about it. If this reaches 400 likes, uh, I will be, uh, I will bring another one of these out tomorrow. Um, this will be quite a late upload, and if this does well, I may consider doing my score builds late on. Uh, I'm going to do my manager modes, like, uh, say, lunchtime, is, well, I might do, and uh, see how it goes from there, guys. So, thank you for watching this video. Please drop a like, please subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Strongest guy